Once you've received your G251X stepper drive, you'll first want to connect a power supply, which in this case is a 24 volt DC supply, a current set resistor, which will be based off of your motor winding current, which this is a 3.5 amp motor. I have a 3.48K 1% quarter watt resistor connected. You'll want to connect your motor to terminals 5, 6, 7, 8, and a step pulse source, which in this case is going to a function generator. Once you have that connected, you can safely power the drive on. And you should hear your motor lock in position, and you should see a red power light. That red power light means everything is working normally. I will then turn on the step pulse input, and you can hear the motor begin moving, and we recommend having it on a sounding board the first time you connect it, something flat and hard, like this motor, uh, like this table, or a uh, wood table, or a metal machine. We do not recommend having it connected to your machine because there's mechanical damping. The smoothness trim pot can be adjusted with a small screwdriver. When that's all connected and set, you can then connect it to your machine and you're done. I hope you enjoy your G251X. Thank you for watching.